Boys and girls, ladies, hmm, hello gentlemen, turn the lights down low and shut your faces as I wrap you in the cozy blanket of a story, a story as heartwarming and soft as a mother's kiss. Who is it? Shh. Once upon a time, there was a boat. Now this wasn't just any boat, children. It was a ship, a ship full of friends, hundreds of friends, best friends, one and all. A veritable friendship it was, get it? But it wouldn't be very ladylike of me if I didn't mention the most noteworthy friend on board, Hattie Hattie. Say hi to Hattie! Hattie was like King Friend of Friendship Kingdom, best friend to one and all, and the walking definition of handsome gentleman. Now one fine morning, Hattie and Pal set out for a new, exciting adventure. What fantastic wonders would they discover this time? Perhaps they'd come across a scary ghost ship. Perhaps they'd find an island made entirely of candy. Perhaps they'd meet a band of scary, swashbuckling pirates and join forces to find an island made entirely of candy. Who knew? But it didn't matter, so long as they were together, there were smiles to be had and adventures to be shared. Now today it was a day like any other adventure day. Spirits were on crushably high, everyone was singing and dancing and having a jolly time. When suddenly the ocean was all like surprise, and a huge, massive storm blew it out of nowhere. Boy, that was quick. And there was thunder. And the lightning. And the wind. Boom! Like that. It was over. Is everyone okay? Said Hattie. I don't know what I'd do if I lost even one of you. Hattie continued. But the eye of the storm is very misleading, children. Never turn your back on it because the ocean was all like, psych! And it came back even bigger this time. Twice as big. As if Poseidon himself extended his hand in friendship and they spat in his mouth. Boy, he was pretty. He was bad. So soon and the rain came down like a shower of bullets. Ah! Ah! And the floorboards were fucking and creaking and breaking and pieces of their ship were raining down like shards of broken dreams. And then Reginald comes upstairs and he's all like, I say, gentlemen, I do believe we're in quite a spot of father. And everyone else was like, really? What is what, genius? And then Hattie was all like, hey, be nice. Whoosh, 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 whoosh. Huge giant waves splash the boat to and fro, fro and to, carelessly sprinkling friend after friend into the cold, unforgiving abyss of the deep, dark ocean. Everyone was screaming like, help me! Splash! Splash! And there was this huge whale like, made it super scary, and I think there was a shark. Whoosh! Yep, there he is! Oh god! Whoosh! What is going to be there? And then Hattie was all like, hold on to your butts! Land ho! And bang, bang, bang! Smash! A shipwreck, as foretold by their fate books of fate. And while it seems like the end, this is merely the beginning of another fantastic journey for the brave crew of the SS Friendship.